report of the National Bureau of Statistics reveals that 40% or 83 million Nigerians live in poverty. It suggests that the number of poor Nigerians exceeds the total population of South Africa, Namibia, Botswana, Lesotho, Mauritius and Eswatini combined. The situation becomes even more precarious with a housing deficit of 25 million. These are some of the concerns the United Nations Rescue Services hopes to address through partnership with the Bayelsa state government. To eradicate poverty and hunger and help the people, you have to give them the basic necessities of life. One of them is the housing challenge in Nigeria. Nigeria has over 25 million deficit of housing and it is increasing by the day. And we decided to initiate to deliver at least 10,000 homes in each of the six geopolitical zones. We made a very passionate appeal to consider Bielsa State as one of the states that is in their need of the intervention of the United Nations. Today, we are happy that you are here to intervene in our situation. As a government, the security of yourself and all those who will be involved in all of these projects are assured. And we ensure that all of the issues that you want to address as you are put in your letter are put down here on ground in Bielsa State. There are also plans to procure and distribute grains and training of 1,000 youth, including the building of 1,000 housing units. It is costing us about 15.7 million to build a two-bedroom bungalow, and we are selling it to you at half of the price. And we are saying anybody that can afford that half of the price, cash, is not qualified to own it. We are looking at the people who have lost hope, the teachers, the market woman the Okada man, the taxi driver, the organizer that I said, park my car and say, pump my tire. Our idea is let them own homes over there. This is a program that is housing for all initiative of the United Nations. So I can guarantee you that we will not disappoint you. The high and mighty in society are not actually um, allowed to handle these projects. And of course, you know that these projects has to do with a lot of partnership, which is uh, goal 17 of the Sustainable Development Goals. Goal, this is partnership. It's a contributory scheme. That's why you see the state governor graciously donating land. Governor Doye Diri was also inducted into the Hall of Fame of the United Nations International Ambassadors. Ovietime George, Arise News.